So we want to provide the child with as much specific appropriate input as we possibly can. And <clears throat> part of that being aware and understanding of, of development. The development of the brain starts from the bottom up, if you will. At the time of birth, the cortex, the thing most of us are concerned about, really isn't operational yet. All right, it's these lower areas of the brain. And the lower areas are often what are recurred, occurred to as motor areas of the brain. And actually for the little kids, moving around is an important function which creates another problem with the daycare kind of environments. Okay, children ideally are left to be on the floor and learn how to crawl on their stomachs, creep on their hands and knees, and then get up and walk. And, you know, that, it doesn't sound like, the, you know, that's a significant deal, but if you think about what that function is, all right, and think that the lower centers are motor centers, when a child learns to crawl on their stomach appropriately, and generally all that means you've got to put them down and give them the chance to be there. They move in what's called a cross pattern, which means they pull with their right arm as they push with their left leg, pull left arm, push right leg. All right? That provides the brain with very good integrated information. Okay? Moving information in an integrated way through the brain, organizing the brain. When they get up on their hands and knees and creep in a cross pattern, they're reinforcing that. And getting up and walking in a cross pattern, they're reinforcing that. We find that if anything disrupts the normal developmental process, we have some degree of disorganization at all higher levels of the brain. Okay, so kids who have problems you know, down at the lower levels are going to typically have problems at the upper levels. You know, so your child's learning problem or attention problem may have originated way back when they were little because of missed, missed opportunities. Okay. You know, one of the saddest things is often, particularly first-time parents, very involved parents, often do a bunch of things to louse stuff up. All right. One is they never put the kids down. Okay. And that first mom walks around with that kid attached to her all day long. All right. Uh, wrong, <laughs> okay? Child needs to be down, needs to have an opportunity to learn how to, learn how to move. And of course, that same mom is the mom who maybe puts the child down, the child's there for 10 seconds and whimpers, whimpers and she runs and grabs them and picks them up again, okay? Uh, moms get trained very quickly, all right? And unfortunately, babies are not wise, okay? All right, they don't make good decisions. You know, <clears throat> so we need the parents to be a little wiser than the children and a little more knowledgeable to know, you know, what to do and uh, hopefully to do the, do the right stuff.